PSLE 2019 Paper 2 Question 11 ABCD is a trapezium EC is equal to ED and ADE is a straight line A. Find angle CED B. The figure is not drawn to scale Each of the statements is either true false or not possible to tell from the information given. For each statement, put a tick to indicate your answer. Firstly, we need to find out where is the parallel lines for the trapezium. Out of the four lines, there's this pair AD and BC. These lines are parallel to each other. Knowing that, the next thing we need to do is to mark out EC and ED because they are equal. Now using the property for uh, angles between parallel lines, we will be able to tell that the two angles should add up to 180 degrees. To find angle ADC, I take 180 minus 30 degrees, I will get 150 degrees. Next, we look at a straight line, AE. Angles on a straight line add up to 180 degrees. So, in order to find CDE, I take 180 degrees minus 150 degrees to get 30 degrees. Next, we look at angles in a triangle and this happens to be an isosceles triangle so there will be two angles that are exactly the same they are DCE and CDE so both of them are 30 degrees continuing from that we will be able to solve for angle CED now we take 180 degrees minus 30 degrees minus 30 degrees and we will get 120 degrees. Now we look at the three statements. The first statement, ABD, is an equilateral triangle. So where is that triangle? Now, in order for a triangle to be equilateral, all three angles must be 60 degrees. Here, we have one angle that is 70 degrees, and the other two angles are unknown. So we can conclude that it must be false. The second statement, ABCE is a parallelogram. In order for this figure to be a parallelogram, one of the properties is that opposite angles must be equal. We take a look at this pair of opposite angles. One of them is 70 degrees. The opposite side is only 60 degrees. We can therefore conclude that ABCE is not a parallelogram. The third statement, BD is perpendicular to DC. In order to do that, there are certain values in the diagram that must be given to us. Right now, there are these four that I have marked with a question mark. All four angles are unknown. So long as one of them is given, we will be able to solve for the other three. Since none of these four question marks are given, we cannot make any conclusion about the value of angle B, D, C. Therefore, we conclude that it is not possible to tell.